guys, I'm back with another video and today is day 13 in the 31 day nail art challenge and today's theme is animal print. So for a base I have on all of my nails, this color's name is Baby Blues and it's from Salon Perfect and this color is super duper duper opaque you guys. I don't know how well you can see this but this is only one coat without a white base underneath of it. This is just the white. I mean, this is just the polish. One coat, you guys. It's freaking awesome. Super opaque. I really like it. And I got it for two bucks because it was 50% off. Go me. And on my ring fingers, I topped that off with Hollow Blue from Clean Color. And this is just a, it's like a blue jelly polish with holographic um, glitters in it. And I actually bought this because of a video I saw from a girl here on YouTube who, she's super new. Um, I'm probably going to butcher her name. It's, I believe it's Sanja. Is her, is Sanja Selmic or something like that. It's, I'll put a link down below of the video I saw her use. She used this one and... No, I lied. She used this one. This is the one that she used, and it's just hollow pink, and it looked so beautiful. The mani that she did, I had to get some for myself, but for some reason, all the places around me, no one carries clean color. I do not know where to get it, so I bought mine on eBay, and it came with a three-pack. So I got the pink, the blue, and the green, and today I decided to top it off with the blue. And for the stamping part, I'm going to be using this plate that I got from AliExpress. It's really big. It's like 8x10 or something like that. And the plate is KM02. And this is a dupe from the Queen plate from the Fireworks plate. From the, I believe it's, what is it? I can't remember the name of the collection, but the, uh, the Celebration collection, that's what it is. And this is a the um, fireworks dupe. So I will link this down below. I do need to caution you when I received my plate it was extremely damaged. This whole corner was bent so I cannot use any part of this of my plate and there's a little dent in the top corner as well so I do want to caution you of that before you go and check it out. So I'm going to be using this image right here and I know this doesn't look like animal print but after it's stamped on the nail it looks like zebra print like really really zebra printy. And I really like it, and it's really big, so it'll cover all my really long nails at the moment. And I'm using Mundo de Unas, number one in white. My Milieu London Rectangular Stamper, and my Creative Shop Scraper. So, let's get started. There's the image, and I'm just going to pop that on my nail, and there you go. See, doesn't it look a lot like zebra print once it's on there? I think it does. And I'm just going to repeat that process for the rest of my nails. There's the image. Whoops, I got a fuzzy. There we go. So let me go ahead and continue stamping the rest of my nails and I'll meet you back for the next step. Okay, so I finished stamping on all of my nails. And there you go. So for my ring fingers, I'm going to put on um, these two little guys. Let me see if I can get them closer for you. It's just a blue bow with white zebra stripes on it. Let's see if I can get it. There we go. It's just a blue bow with white um, zebra stripes on it. It's really cute and just a little rhinestone in the middle. And I got these actually from Five Below today. I had a different Manny planned for today. And then I found this little pack it was like three bucks or something, two or three dollars. And it's got nine different pairs of bows. They're really cute. See, this one's pink zebra. 
This one's got like a traditional like leopard print style. This one's got polka dots, black and white, pink and white. This one's just got black and white checkers. Um, what is this? This one can either be yellow with black polka dots or like a cheetah print. And then this one's got a pink, white, and black leopard print. All really, really cute. But I really like these for some reason. I've really been going towards blue stuff lately. So I really like these and I thought I would grab them and do a mani based around them. So I've got my top coat here. I'm just going to put a little blob of it there. I got my tweezers, which I don't know if they're going to help me or not, or hurt me. So we're, let's see. Maybe this one. Come here, little guy. You know you want to. Here. I'm just going to use my fingers because my tweezers don't want to pick this up. Okay. There we go. I got it on there. Okay, I think I did it. There we go. I think that's really cute. I really like that. You guys like it? Let me know what you guys think of these little bows. I usually don't use this kind of thing, but... I think they're really cute, so I wanted to try them out, and I'm kind of glad I did. I like it. So let me go ahead and put the other bow on, clean up, and top coat, and I will meet you back to show you the finished result. Okay, guys, so I cleaned up and top coated, and this is the finished result. I think it came out really cute. I really like the little bows. I think they're adorable. <laughs> So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up, comment down below, subscribe, and come back to see me next time. Bye!